And voting for primary elections is underway in Indiana today. Thousands are set to make their way to the polls this afternoon. Polling locations will be open until 6 p.m. tonight. There are several open throughout Vandenberg County. You can find a full list of the most convenient locations for you on evansvillegov.org. And here are some of the top races we're following. Six Republicans are vying for the seat being vacated by outgoing Governor Eric Holcomb. First up is Senator Mike Braun, who's been endorsed by Republican former President Donald Trump and Brad Chambers. Also looking to make it is Suzanne Crouch, whose platform is about axing Hoosiers taxes. And running alongside them is Eric Doden from Fort Wayne. Curtis Hill and Jamie Rittenauer are the last names on the ballot vying for the Republican nomination. Since Senator Mike Braun is looking to get on the ballot for governor, that leaves a seat open for a U.S. Senator spot. The Democratic race is between Mark Carmichael and Valerie McRae for voters to choose from. And next is U.S. Representative for the 8th District on the Republican side. Not pictured here is Justin Case and Jeremy Heath. John Hostetler, who's a former U.S. representative, and Dominic Cavanaugh. Mark Bessmer and Luke Misner are also on that ballot. And lastly, Richard Moss and Christy Risk. Next is U.S. representative for the 8th District on the Democratic side is Eric Hurt. And not pictured there is Peter Priest, plus Edward Sian and Markle Talerzik are on that ballot as well. Another big race in the Indiana primaries is for state representative 64th district Republican side. That's between incumbent Matt Hostetler and Dale Mallory. And here in Vanderbilt County, we're keeping a close eye on the Vanderbilt County Commissioner 3rd district Republican race. That race is between Amy Canterbury and incumbent Cheryl Musgrave, who have been trying to win voters over the last couple of months. And for Warwick County Commissioner, 1st District, Republican side, battling it out are Sarah Mills, Seton, and Richard Reed. They're both trying to unseat incumbent Dan Saylor. And our last big race we're keeping a close eye on is Warwick County Commissioner, 3rd District, Republican Stacey France and incumbent Bob Johnson, both going up against Steve Spinks. We'll download our 44 News app to see updates throughout the night on poll results and stay with 44 News on air this evening as we bring you the latest in the Indiana primaries.